Hi everybody, welcome to Reality Buzz TV. So let's talk about this D situation, okay? <laughs> this is what I don't understand about uh, the D story because I felt like it was an issue about certain cast members feeling like Umaria set on certain body parts, Zigan Nil, which made the situation inappropriate because she is a married woman. I thought okay. there was a situation. And now I'm not understanding you guys because I'm watching episode nine. And the whole thing now has turned to uh, being that the others have an issue with Neil's sexuality. How did we get there? Because I don't remember anybody saying that they have an issue with the fact that Neil is gay. I don't think that anybody was arguing about the fact that Neil is gay. Everybody agrees Neil is gay. But it was just the way that Maria was sitting on his body parts that for other people it looked inappropriate. Okay. Now, when the ladies are telling Neil the story, they bring up the fact that uh, the other ladies are having an issue with his sexuality. They are attacking him for who he is. I'm not understanding that, guys. How does somebody saying you're sitting on somebody's D equates to them having an issue with your sexuality? You know, why are we acting like if we had to stretch it, why are we acting like if a man is gay, they can never have, you know, uh, intimacy with a woman? Why are we acting like that? Like the dick just wouldn't react if a woman is sitting on it. If it's inappropriate for a woman to sit on a man's day, Neil is still a man. He's just a gay man. <laughs> so it's just as inappropriate as it would be with any other man. I don't understand it. If 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 uh, Maria had a male friend that wasn't gay and he, she sat on, you know, his body parts, it was feel inappropriate. Why is it appropriate? Just because. Uh, Neil is gay. I'm not understanding that, guys. And also, they were not saying anything about you being gay. Nobody <laughs> complained about you being gay. Nobody said that they don't like the fact that you're gay. They are just saying your friend was sitting on your body parts. And guys, did you have you noticed, Dugoti? They are not denying that that happened. Maria is not denying that it happened. Jojo is not denying it. Um, it's only Nonku, but Nonku is a lie. We know that Nonku is a liar. And even Neil himself is not denying what Maria said on him. They're just feeling like the other lady shouldn't make a big deal because he is gay. But if the other ladies looked at that and felt like it looks inappropriate, why can't they feel like that? The only thing that maybe they can complain about is the fact that Amy brought it up to hurt Maria's feelings. It wasn't like it was in a friendly conversation where... Amy was like, hey, but Maria, how can you sit on, you know, that thing look inappropriate, girl, because you're, you're a married girl. Why would you sit on a man like that in front of everybody? It, she brought it up because she was trying to hurt Maria. That I get, you know, that's the thing that you can say is wrong, that she brought it up to hurt Maria's feelings. But if you did say, because you're not denying you sat on his body parts, he is not denying that you sat on his body parts. Even your friends are not denying you sat on your parts. Nonko is denying, Nonko says it is a lie because Neil is gay. So Maria didn't sit on Neil because Neil is gay. That doesn't make sense. You can sit on somebody that is gay. So what, what is the pro? Like, I'm not understanding it, guys. Why has it moved now to, oh, Neil is now, uh, the others are now having a problem with Neil, okay? They can have a problem with the fact that the others are thinking it's inappropriate. He can say, listen, Maria is my friend, so we do all kinds of stuff. This is something that we do. He can sit, she can sit on my D. It's not an issue. She can he can defend himself like that. But it's not because people are upset that you are gay. I was not understanding, you guys, what is he crying about? What the hell is Neil crying about now? Uh, she, he, she, he was so hurt, I guess, maybe because... Then they are implying that they're having an affair with Maria, which is not even what they were saying. People were saying, this woman is seeing on your private body parts. It looks inappropriate for a married woman. And and nobody's denying that that happened except for Nongu, which means that it's likely that it happened. Okay, Whether it was innocent on, you, on Neil and Maria's parts, maybe it was, but 
if the others saw it and thought it looked inappropriate, then it looked that way to them. But it's only about Maria sitting on his body part. It's not about him being a gay. Does, I don't know, I was like, does he not have the body parts? <laughs> he does have the body. So if Maria sat on the body part, did she not? Sit? I'm not understanding this, you guys. Maybe some of you would be able to explain it to me how it has moved. My bet is running out. How it has moved to nil saying others have a problem with him being gay because I did not feel like that was the situation. I felt like people were just saying, this woman sitting on you like that is inappropriate. You can be upset about that, but it was never about people having an issue with you being gay. It just wasn't about that. I feel like I'm, I'm short. Like, what's, yeah, they have an issue with the husbands. They have an issue with their sexuality. No, it wasn't that. It was, they have an issue with Maria sitting on your body parts, which we assume still work, even though you are gay. So it still is inappropriate for a woman to just be sitting on a man's parts. Okay. Anyway, you guys, maybe you will let me know in the comment section if you understood it better than me because I'm just not getting it. I'm not getting how now it's about Neil's sexuality. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. Like it before you want to share it with your friends, with your family, and even with strangers in the Tanda Gakon.